People in Forsyth say a group of teenagers is causing problems for businesses. They say they're doing things like stealing, vandalizing cars, and pulling fire alarms. Now, deputies are stepping in to try and stop it. WCNI3's Courtney Bunting is live in our newsroom. So, Courtney, where exactly is this happening? Well, Jennifer, people I talk to say these kids usually start gathering at Hickory Point Mall. They're now asked to leave the mall three hours before closing because of it. However, after they leave, mall employees say they often head to nearby businesses like McDonald's or Red Lobster. Village Mayor Marilyn Johnson says two cars were damaged in Red Lobster's parking lot earlier this month, and she believes it was this group of kids who did it. I talked to one woman who works at the mall, and she's frustrated by the problem. She feels there should be more to entertain kids at night to keep them out of trouble. They're running, they're screaming, screaming expletives, trying to fight. Um, it's usually a big group of them. The security does the best that they can, but usually they have to be run out. Uh, they have a policy over there where they kick them out by six, but even then they just still keep coming and coming. Talk to village administrator David Stroll. He says village leaders met with the sheriff's office and the businesses affected to discuss this issue. And the Macon County Sheriff's Office has added more patrols around the mall area. They have now have extra officers patrolling on Fridays and Saturday in Forsyth from there two, which is normal, now up to four. Reporting live in the control room, Courtney Bunting, WCAA3, your local news leader. And let's hope that does the trick. All right, thank you, Courtney.